Hello, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Become the Eleanor Archer. It is pouring rain and thunder and lightning and riften. So we're at level 12. And uh, I did put one other perk into enchanting uh, when I, after the last episode. And improved my gear a bit and stuff like that. Put some... Um, some enchantments on that to make my conjuration less expensive. So I can uh, conjure both now. Both the Atronach and the uh, Bound Bow together. So we are here. We're going to go do talk to Sibby Black Blackbriar about Frost. What are you doing down here? It's fine. Oh, my mistake then. Sorry. You can go on ahead. We are not the elves you're looking for. I used to be an adventurer like you. Then I took an arrow in the knee. Well, well, aren't you a sight for sore eyes? I've always got time for lovely ladies. Creeper. Ah. Let me guess. He wants his horse. Well, that's going to be a bit of a problem. See, I don't really outright own Frost. What do you mean? Is You're some kind of criminal? See, Frost belongs to the Blackbriar estate. Technically, everything in the estate is owned by my mother, Maven. My plan was to take the horse from our lodge and deliver it to Latrush at the stables. Obviously, that didn't exactly work out as I'd planned. Still, I don't want to cross Latrush. Tell you what, steal the horse and deliver it, and you can have the second half of the payment. Or I can keep the horse. Then I think we're done talking. Right. So go get the lineage papers. If you're looking to settle in Riften, there's a house with you. What is it? Oh, that was loud. Gotta head over there. So here we are outside the Blackbriar Lodge. I think that's what it's called. Who's this guy? How you oh, there's one of their mercenaries. Hmm, weighs a lot, but it's worth quite a bit. What? Who's shooting at me? Oh, he's up there. Another one of the mercenaries. Oh, what an awesome shot. Wait, I guess. Gotta go in there. He's a little tougher. There's no escape. 
unfortunately he wasn't. I guess I can take all of their armor. Could get feigned all some of it, but eh. It's not that important. So, where is it? Here. Is that downstairs? I don't want to break into a master, master level lock. There we go. Frost, stallion, silvery white. So, where is this horse then? Right next to me, apparently. Shouldn't it be in the... Oh. What's it doing over there? Okay. Nice purple saddle. Looking good. Can't wait till I have my armor. All right, where we gotta go? Well, Trush is over there. Hey, leave my horse alone. Don't want to hit my Trush. That wouldn't be good. Oh, well, that was easy. Let's make the exchange. So I'm going to keep a dangerous it. game, my friend. Fine, you win. Take the horse and leave. He'll probably send somebody after me, but that's okay. All right. So next stop is Iverstad. I got to talk to some kids. Crazy kids about their love. Not planning any trouble. What can I do for you, friend? Why are you guys all sitting like that on the bench? So fast are you the one sent by Mara? Yes, I am. What is troubling you, child? She spoke to me in a dream. She said a stranger would appear to help me. Is that you? My parents are being impossible. Bassianus wants to marry me. I think I love him. But he wants to think? move to Riften afterwards, and my father won't allow it. He only cares about this stupid town. But Bassianus makes me happier than anyone ever has. My mother's not any help either. Um. Oh, thank you so much. You do sound confused, but I guess I'll talk to your parents. Settle down to have children. Think twice before you do it. <laughs> okay. You having some trouble? I'm sure I know what this is about. She thinks she's in love with Bassianus and wants to leave town. With him. Let me tell you how I see it. Until a few months ago, the girl was head over heels for Clement. But he stopped talking about it. Now, if I thought she was really in love with Bassianus, that would be one thing. It will pass. Hmm. Look around here. There's not much left. It used to be a good-sized town. The folks have been moving to Riften for a while now. If all the young people leave, what happens to Iverson? It uh, you know dies. How children are. Her fancies change with the moon. And like always, the boy lacks any kind of spine. He needs some convincing. A little push, and this would all be simple. I see. So you want me to do your dirty work you for you? For Talk about spineless. Why don't you just talk pilgrim. to him? You must be another pilgrim on. 
Oh my. Probably something about the men. We all wish we had our problems. I don't tell my husband. But I don't have any problem with Bassianus. Even if it means her leaving Iverstead, I want Fastra to be happy. If they just snuck out of town together, I could manage my husband. Um. Bassianus is still so terrified of Yoththor. If he knew that I'd keep him from hunting the poor boy down, he'd take Fastra to Riften without a second thought. Let him know that I'll watch out for them. Just want my daughter to be happy. Sounds really messed up, but okay. Sure, leave. Everyone if this else is does. <laughs> okay. Sorry. Uh, if this is what Mara wants, this is what Mara gets. So I take it. Lucianus is in the inn, getting drunk. You don't look like a pilgrim. Why bother visiting Iverstead? Oh, my love. How I long to take her away from all of this. Why did Boti send you to me? Um, you should elope. I always had a feeling she liked me. More than that brute Yoththor, at least. Yoththor? What about him? He'll come after us and it will be unpleasant. Oh, brother. She would. If she's willing to deal with him, then everything would be all right. I'll... I'll go speak to Fastrid, post-haste. Right. Okay, you go do that. Um... <coughs> ow! So, I guess he has to actually speak to her before the quest is completed. What? Whoa. It's locked now? Um... Should I just wait outside here? I don't want to break in. There's like a guard like right there. Okay. Wait an hour. Anything? No. You must be another pilgrim on the way up to high. No Hoffa. new. No other reason to pass through here. Dialogue options. Crazy. Sure. No. But forgive me if I'm a bit on edge. Hmm. Okay, I'll wait. That didn't do anything. I'll wait till tonight. Maybe they're gonna come out sneaking or something. He you went inside. Down to oh. Have children. Think twice before you do it. Uh huh. Okay, so it's I can get in at least. Bastard, we must speak. Uh, what? Sweet. The what heck? Is it? We must leave. Your father will never approve of us, and I grow weary of this place. Where you know, maybe it's go? because you're standing on his table. To rift in my pet, how you'll adore the city. Oh, and to be with you. I'll make the preparations immediately. Ah. It's a fine day with you around. I thought you loved Bassianus. Good to see you. Right. Finally, okay. Well, around. we will see you in the next episode.